Yeah. Yeah. From Tamil Nadu? Yeah. Okay, okay. Vanakkam. Vanakkam. <laughs> All right. So, so this is inside the palace guys really large you can see with all the columns and everything like that so this was one of the king's palace who ruled here in uh, Tamil Nadu who, who is this one I know this is Hanuman eh? all right that was very interesting in there in the temple and you can see uh, it's a very ancient temple you can tell by the Banakkam. Okay guys, so we are another temple here in uh, Madurai. It's a big one as well. So it's the Aru Migu Kalagar temple dedicated to Vishnu or Sri Vishnu shrine they call it. So you can see people are selling here. Banakkam. Alright. Yakmidi Iri King eh? <laughs> okay so we got different devotees that's coming from the temple we got we got some uh, cows here first time i've seen cows tied up this is interesting we got someone cleaning there all right say something nice So this is the temple dedicated to Vishnu, a very important god in the uh, Hinduism. So you got different devotees just sitting down waiting, some are going in, alright. So this is the entry here, we have Darshan, alright. All right, so I have a puttu on my head here, so you get that when you come to the temple here. So to get in, we gotta pass this way. I wasn't allowed to film that side, so let's see what's going on. Can I come? Yeah, yeah. Many different people coming here. All right, can I come? Yeah, can I come? But I come. Hey. We're greeting people. You got people. I don't know what they're doing over there. All right. It's a lot going on. So I think we're going to the Balaji Temple. Balaji. So over here you can buy different things for offering and all of that good stuff. We're just strolling. So immediately we're greeted with some colorful painting here. I believe this one on the right here that is Hanuman. I'm not sure this one who this one will be that might be Vishnu when I come all right my friend when I come Angilam Terima who is this one I know this is Hanuman eh? Gadal Gadalwar Gadal 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 oh Hanuman yeah all right the Nandi when I come thank you all right so this this is it guys so the names
Wow. So similar to the uh, Manish temple here in uh, Madurai, same kind of colorful motifs and different deities and stuff. Very colorful, but it seems like they're doing some renovation here. Wow. Can I come? All right. <laughs> so we got a lot going on. Wow. Guys, I must say, you can tell these are very ancient structures that we're seeing here, we're witnessing. Wow. Can I come? All right. A very serene environment here. You could hear the hymns. Let's take a walk inside and see what's going on. When I come. Look at the ancient structures of these buildings, guys. Wow. All right, that was very interesting in there in the temple. And you can see uh, it's a very ancient temple. You can tell by the design of the building, the stones that was being used and different um you know motifs of the idols and stuff how it was built so very ancient building but as you go deeper in the temple you're not allowed to take pictures inside or take videos so i couldn't really take too much videos when i was inside but yeah if you want to get an experience to see what this temple is like here in tamil nadu definitely check it out guys Wow, this is it. It's an elephant coming. Wow. I believe now they have something called uh, Dashan which is kind of like um, maybe like evening prayers or something like that so a lot of people are devotees are coming to the temple right now and this is the entrance this is where they will get in So I'm at a very interesting site here. So to many people, Mahatma Gandhi is considered the father of the nation here in India. And he used to spend a lot of time in Madras when he came. In fact, the garments you see him wearing, he got inspiration from the farming community here in Madras in southern India, which is today, of course, Tamil Nadu. Now, this is the place he would have stayed when he, when he came here. And it's now a museum located here in Madurai, here in Tamil Nadu. So let's go in and have a look about, about it and see what it's like. So we're walking in. So this is the museum time. It's, this is what it says here. It reads Gandhi Memorial Museum and it opened it from 10 a.m. in the morning to 1 p.m. and then from 2 p.m. to 5.45 and it's free entry according to this sign so you can see there are some people visiting my vlog 
You want to be in my vlog? Uh, you want to say hello? Uh, yes. Yeah, so. What do I have to tell you? No, we we're all on the tour together. Hi, hello, Jessica. Yeah, just hello. <laughs> how, how are you like in the museum? You like it? Oh yeah, it's fun. No, no, oh yeah. All right, no problem. So yeah, we're all on a tour together. You guys want to say hello in the vlog? Come say hello, hello. Hi. And, and how, what, what, is, what's you guys' experience of visiting the museum today? Nation, Mahatma Gandhi. You like it? Are we exploring? Yeah. Yes. Okay, all right. Our grandfather. All right, no problem. The father of the nation yeah, of yeah. India. Here, yeah. yeah. Yes. All right, no problem. Nice to meet you guys. Yeah, yeah we're all on a tour together. Indian grandfather. All yeah. right. All right, no problem. Thank you. All right. Yeah. So real cool. Um, we're on a tour together. So yeah, just looking around. What else have they got here? Indian fight for freedom. So it talks about, I guess, India fight during the colonial times and you have all the I guess heroes people of importance here in India Wow this is interesting I'm taking a photo Wow so this is um, General Havelock's attack on Nana Sahib. Now, Nana Sahib of the family of the Peshawars led the rebellion in central India with a lack of rupees on his head. He fought ferociously like an animal in, in a wounded rage, striking terror into the English with his daring and lightning attacks. So he had a lack on his head, that's the money, the currency used here in India. And he fought against the colonialism that was happening here in India. And of course, General Havelock was the person who led the attack. And you have pictures of that right here, which talked about it. Now this is Nana Sahib. This is a portrait of him here. So very interesting, some of the things we're learning here, guys. Here again, we have something about the, uh, let's see, Sepoys at Meerut rose in revolt on May 10, 1857, killing off the English officers and settling ablaze their bungalows. They marched to Delhi, the capital of Hindustan. That's very interesting. India was known as Hindustan and captured the city with the spoils at Delhi joining them. So. This is interesting here guys, we saw the fight against the, you know, the British here and uh, how they won some battles, they lost some battles. So these are all things we're learning as you come to the Gandhi Museum. So that's very interesting here guys. Let's go on. The Mata and Sikh resistance. So the Sikh community or is a community in the Punjab region, which is North India and they also went up and fought against the colonial colonialism here in india and you learn about all of these things when you come to the museum here so this is very interesting guys yes sir oh from england england yeah yeah well, what's your name my name is Pati Dhan, what is your name? I'm Mani. Okay, very well. Yeah, yeah, where are you from? I'm from uh, Odisha, you know. No, where is that? Yeah, we are from India, I'm yeah. from Odisha. What language do you speak? Uh, Odisha language. Odisha? Oh, yeah. oh yeah. you don't speak Tamil? Some... Punjab, Punjab? Punjab, Punjab. Oh, but Hindi? Hindi on the top, full name. Oh, full name? Full name. Oh, okay. What is your name? My name is Pati Dhan, what is your name? My name is Imani. Very good. 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 Okay, thanks. <laughs> All right, so yeah, well, nice to meet you. I'm just okay, gonna just a, 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 a vlog about the museum. Your selfie. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna take a selfie and continue looking. All right, so we was just exploring the inside of the museum here in Madurai. Now we're going and see what else the museum have to offer. All right. So this is the outside there 
What's this building here? Let's see what's going on. Hello, hello, hi, hi. <laughs> yeah, from Tamil Nadu. Okay, okay, Vanakkam. Vanakkam. <laughs> All right. So, England. Yeah, yeah. Imani. Yen Pera? Imani. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, we could take a, a selfie. Why not, man? All right, so this is just a kind of a hut here just outside the museum by um, the Mahatma Gandhi Museum here in Madurai. And we got some students here. They're all welcome and greeting me. Say hello, hello. hello. All right. All right, then. Nandiri Barakkam. Yeah, yeah, I'll, you'll see this on Instagram. All right, thank you. Don't forget to watch Kalamari 67. Which, which one? <laughs> All right, then. Nandri. <laughs> yeah, real cool people, you know. Everyone's just coming out here to. Whoa, I gotta go. <laughs> the bus is here, guys. So, this is pretty much it at the museum. Gotta get on my tour bus. Wow. Talking too much. All right, see you guys. All right. <laughs> All right. Back on the bus. Thank you. Whoa, whoa. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I'm coming, coming. <laughs> Good day, fine. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Yeah. Back on the tour bus now, guys. So on to another destination, but you can definitely check out Mahatma Gandhi Museum here in Madurai. It's a good experience if you want to learn more about the history and culture here in India. Peace. All right, first off with the tour, I'm going to be here at the Teru Malai Palace here in Teru Malai Nayak Palace here in Madurai. Now it was the palace of uh, King Nayak who ruled this region here from around 1623 I believe to 1657 something like that. So we're gonna go in and have a look what it's like. It's a very popular place that you could come and check out if you ever come to Madurai. So this is the entrance here. I believe it's around uh, Barakam. I believe it's around uh, 10, 10 uh, rupees to get in. So let's check it out. People are coming out right now. So this is the palace. Hello, my friend. When I come, yak bari the king. Yeah, nalam, nalam. Yeah, how much? Thirty. Thirty rupees. I come when I I go in and come back. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. How are you? Your name? Yen Pera Imani. 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 Yeah. I am name Sarkan. Sar Sarkan. Ah, I am name Sarkan. Nala Pera. Nala Pera. Ah, yeah. Palankan. Palankan. Ah, All Palankan. Right. No, you're joking. No, no, Palankan. All right. So, this is the entrance to the palace right here, guys. Those guys are selling some fruits, um, pineapple, uh, watermelon and stuff like that. So, let's go and check out the ticket counter. And have a quick wonder. So, we're walking in now, sorry, excuse me. So, this is the ticket counter right here. Wow. So this is inside the palace guys Really large You can see with all the columns and everything like that So this was one of the king's palace who ruled here In uh, Tamil Nadu at one time So this is something you can do to come in here If you got a camera or phone you play around 80 rupees to come inside this amazing attraction there are A lot of people here Wow, look at all the columns guys. This is beautiful. Different people coming out. But look at the intricate designs of this place. Wow. Wow. 
Wow. Let's pause the other way. Have you guys been here before? Let me know what you think. These pillars are huge, I can't even hug it. It's huge, man. Wow. So it's literally just an empty building here, to be honest. And I guess you could admire the architecture of the place, the designs and all of that. England? India. Yeah. Which country? Yes. India? Yes, India. Oh, okay. <laughs> so you got students that come here and do what they do? So within the palace, as well, you have the Tirumalai Nayaka Palace Museum as well, where you could learn about the various things. So let's see what they say here. We've got a bit of information. This royal palace was built in 1636 by Trinko Malia, the greatest Thiro Malia Naikar, the greatest of the Nayak rulers of Madurai. The building we see today was the main portion where he lived and held his court. It is believed that the original palace was four times bigger than what it was today. So it, it was believed it was bigger than what it is today. So this is just a part of it that remains today. So that's very interesting. So this is the sign here. So this is like a museum here, you know quite empty but it got a few pictures and a few stone carvings these are very interesting it says Chamundi this is from the 10th century very very interesting they seem to be all female I believe this might be Ganesha so very very interesting what we're seeing here in the palace walls I'm gonna take a walk around so you have the Jain ascetic Jain is another major religion here in India Jainism sorry about the darkness guys it's a bit dark in here These are some of the artwork. Very interesting. Got more artwork. The females, they look like they're topless. And certain dances as well. Very interesting. This was the palace here a long time ago view from the lower corridor at the southern side of the palace wow so this is all it guys wow
All right, guys, to end the trip, we're going to the Murugan Temple. Murugan has often been called the god of the Tamils. When I come, all right, <laughs> when I come, <laughs> all right, so we're walking. We got people coming from the temple now. So, this is the Murugan Temple here. So we've seen a few temples today on this tour. So we're gonna check out the Murigan Temple in Madurai. A lot of people come in from all different parts of India to check it out. A lot of people selling things here. You know? Liking it, I'm liking it. Yeah, Vanakkam. Alright, Vanakkam. Alright. Yeah, hello, Akpuri Eri Kinga. Nala. Alright, Nala. Huh? England. England. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright then. Poita Warden. Alright, alright. So we're moving, we're moving along. This is the temple entrance here. So let's see, quite colorful. Similar to what we've seen in many of the temples across uh, South India here. You gotta remove your shoes when you go into the temples. And I've seen quite a few monkeys which are nearby. Wow. So this is like the, in the entrance area where people are coming and going. You can see in there, due to respect um, for the camera, I'm not going to go in and um, do much filming in there, but I'll be standing out here. So yeah, this is the temple of Morigan here in India, guys. So I've been doing a full tour of various places and we've seen some of the main temples here today, guys. So let me know what you think about today's video. I appreciate every one of you tuning in and watching as we get a real cultural experience here in India. Peace.